When you're a content creator, it comes easy. But when you aren't so creative, it becomes a challenge. And so I wanted to speak about, I'm going to talk about how to use Canva. I'm going to do a quick tutorial on Canva, which it is something that is very useful for people who don't have any type of creativity or don't know how to create designs or images that they might need for their brand or business or an event. So stay tuned for a quick tutorial on how to use Canva. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to talk to you about how to use Canva like a professional. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. So if you're looking at my screen here, you'll see that we're at the whole beginning of at the home page of Canva. So if you do not have an account, I do have my link at the bottom of the description where you can once after you watch this video, you can go right to the link and sign up. When you do sign up, you can choose to use an email, your Google account, your Facebook account, or any um, other email like Yahoo. I personally use my Google business account, so I'm going to go ahead and log in. Once you log in, you are now at the beginning of the homepage of the design castle, I call it. Canva is one of the greatest places if you aren't a content creator and you need to create something for an event, for a party, for any special reason or occasion, even for just social media, this is the place you want to do it at on Canva. A lot of people out here find it um, challenging, but you just got to take your time and go through it. Okay, so basically they have all of these templates that you can use. You have a uh, whiteboard, Facebook posts, videos. See right here, it says you might want to try. This is like a quick shortcut to your templates. This arrow shows all of your templates, your uh, web website template, a logo, an Instagram story, um, an Instagram post. Um, also, Facebook covers, a gift certificates. At the right hand corner, at the top, if you want to start from scratch, you'll hit create a design. It gives you a drop down box with a list of blank canvas that you can use a whiteboard uh, for a Facebook post, for a video, for a presentation, for a flyer, for a website or a logo. And the list goes on. Down here, you can hit custom size, you can edit a photo, or you can import a, a PDF document or a Word document here. With the custom size, if you click it, it's going to just ask you to type in what your pixel size is, your inches, your millimeters, or your centimeters. All right. On the left hand side is another uh, list, okay, where you can hit templates. Your projects would be all of the things that you're creating on Canva. Then your brand, this is actually one of my favorite tabs. I'm going to open this one up. If you hit brand, you can customize all your all your brand colors, your font. There go my fonts. There go my colors. And see, I manage several businesses, businesses so I have their colors already locked in. So that when I do any type of creation, I can come right here and, it, and I named it the BGP branding kit. All right. And then I also can you can incorporate your own templates that you can use. I don't have any because I pretty much just I just use any type of templates. All right. Um, one thing it comes with is a content planner. If you don't have a content planner that you literally use, you can use one right here. It'll definitely make you accountable because it will it will connect to your all your digital platforms and send you um, notices and things like that, notifications, templates. So let's go back to the templates because mainly one of the main reasons people. Um, want to get some business out or whatever's going on maybe you have a business you want to promote it this is the platform that you should use um and the templates well you got business social media videos marketing custom prints cards and invitations education if i click on business it's going to pull up all the templates that i could use for a business presentations whiteboard 
process or I could just scroll down. Scroll down and you'll see all of these business templates. A whole rare and let's go to social media, which is what we are on these days. I love it because all of your social media templates are here. Your Instagram posts, your stories, your reels, your Facebook posts, covers, or ads. How do we, How many of us are trying to make ads online? Well, here go templates that you can use. I'm going to click on the ads because right here, here are all the different ads that they'll you can use. You just go in there, which my next tutorial will be on how to design using these materials because there are so many different unique ways to use them and to customize them, okay? And so um, education, if you're a teacher, you need to do a presentation for your, your classmates. You can kick on presentation or if you need something for info um, graphics, classroom posters. Listen, you, you if you um, need it, they got it, all right? These are some excellent templates. Like you see right here, one of nine. Well, one of nine, if I let's preview it, we can preview the template. It's going to give me, for a presentation, nine templates. Y'all, y'all can't beat this beat using Canva. If you don't have it, my description link is in the description below is my link. So make sure you click on that link and get you set up and you can do it for free. Okay, so let's see how we can do it for free. So I'll go to some of my projects because I stay pretty busy. Okay, um, these are projects I've been going working on. My tab is full of projects. So if you, once you start working, you can always go here to find some, if you need to go back to a template, you can go here and you can hit make, uh, make a copy. You can make a folder and you can customize them to different folders and organize them. You can also download them right here just if, without even opening up the design, okay? So let's talk about pricing, all right? You can sign up for free. You can design forever for free. Uh, they don't give you all of the, the unique tablets, but you can do it for free, okay? Um, you can do it as a pro. You can do it for team. When you sign up, you go, if you go to this right bubble over here, let's kick on uh, account settings and we'll go back to pricing. This is where you customize your, your accounts. This is my profile is my logo. It can be a picture of you, but you want to make sure you do that. I'm a small business. However, you can be a student, a teacher, or you can be a large company, a nonprofit, or you can have this for personal reasons. Okay. And then over here, I have the team plan. And so I'm able to have teams that can sign up under my plan and work under me for free. And so um, that's where the free comes in at for your team. So let's look at it. Right. So basically, you can go through these at your your convenient time and you'll see the different plans. You can get it for free and go through the checklist so you can see what, what you're getting for free or what you're getting from each plan. You can do one nineteen ninety nine annually or like I said, if you have a team, you can do $149.90 up to five people, y'all. That's the steal, especially if you're an organization and you have, you know, you have a team. And I love this plan for teachers. People don't even know about this. If you're a teacher, um, for, you get 100% free usage of Canva if for primary and secondary teachers and their students. You just got to follow that checklist and get verified. You also, if you're um, in the school districts for kindergarten up to 12, 100% free. You just got to contact Canva. Make sure you go and subscribe below and so that we can get you started on getting your own, doing your own designs. And I'm going to be doing tutorials to teach you how to do it yourself. Okay. So I'm just going to go back to the beginning here and just so you guys can kind of see. Um, this at the right hand, I mean, the right bottom corners where they chat, you can chat with them and someone that's going to be available to help you. Okay. So this is where you start. You don't have to think anymore. You don't have to wonder. You just got to open up your Canva, start your Canva account and, and start creating. I will, my next tutorial would be, let's create something together. I'll create a design. If there's something you would like me to create. Leave it in a comment below and I will 
and I will choose one of the designs and I'll create it live. So make sure you subscribe to my channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I look forward to seeing you again next time soon. And remember, through me, they see you. It's go time. Peace.